Apple and Apps.com checking in with iOS 6 and now we're taking a look at Apple's redesigned App Store, iTunes Store, and iBooks Store beginning with the App Store. As you can tell the design's completely different though not necessarily uh, improved I guess. I mean it's more touchable but it's not any easier to find new apps which is really the main drawback of the App Store. But anyway you have uh, the new and featured tabs are now scrollable from left to right and then when you tap on an app you get the new improved product page with details reviews and related right at the top of the screen and you can also like apps and the related function I guess helps somewhat for app discovery and you can also share anything right from the app store page you can view the in-app purchases the developers other apps and the update history which uh, was only on the iPad before so it's nice to see it come to the iPhone and then the purchase tab is relatively the same. Once you're back on the featured page and you look at all the new apps of the week, it's the same list as before so that's not that interesting. But all three stores now have these new views where there's a black top and bottom bar with a scrollable banner at the top and then featured items that are available in the left right scroll. And that's also the same when you drill down into the categories for each store, whether it be apps like we're showing you, or music, TV shows, movies, and books. So as you can see here, when you launch up the iTunes store, it's a lot like the App Store, just with different items filling the different store fronts. But Apple's unified all three of their stores on the iPhone side, and they've improved it just to make it more touchable, no matter what section you're in. And it also makes it easier to really buy things, I guess, which is Apple's main goal, since they have over 400 million different iTunes accounts with credit cards. But I guess the biggest addition to the App Store is actually the feature set, in that now, say you're viewing the top free charts and you install Bagit, well, it doesn't take you out of the App Store. It just starts installing. You can see the progress right in the App Store. But then you can go on and install other apps you know, rather than exiting out the App Store, going back in. And then once everything is installed, you can open apps right from within the App Store, which is a neat little thing. And it's just an easier way to use the App Store and keep browsing without jumping out each and every time. And the same is for iTunes and iBooks. The same progress on an app page in the App Store is the same. And also, once an app installed, there's a new little new banner right in the top right corner, which you hopefully uh, saw right there real quick. And now iBooks is, again, the same thing. So that's the three digital stores. They come with new design and new features. Hope you enjoyed the video.